A 14-year-old boy died on September, a month after he was bitten by his neighbor's dog in Charansing colony of Ghaziabad. The family members of the boy alleged that the dog that bit the 14-year-old in the right leg was not vaccinated. Recently, a case is doing all the rounds on social media platform wherein a child, 14-year-old in 8th standard, was bitten by his neighbor's dog. Because of the fear of getting scolded by his parents, he did not tell them and that wound was unattended for one long month. And that caused the spread of infection which made him behave abnormally. On later on medical advice, it was diagnosed as rabies and since it is a fatal disease, that 14 year old lost his life to rabies. Well, what is rabies? Let's get into it. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Kanaka and welcome back to Dr. Do. disease caused by a virus of raptovirus family. Now it is actually present in the salivary glands of rabbit animals like dog and even in bats. So now when that animal bites you so through the skin which abrasion takes place the virus is injected by the saliva and thus the entire process of the disease begins. What actually happens is when that rabbit or the infected animal bites you so at the site of the bite that muscle is the place where replication of that virus takes place now after replicating through the help of the nerves it infects the peripheral nervous system and also towards the central nervous system it reaches the dorsal root ganglion and again replicates over there and makes pathway towards spinal cord and brain and spinal cord both get infected which again later on starts traveling towards other body parts so gradually this virus spreads to each and every body part thus infecting every part and causing deterioration in the function of every body part when the animal bites you from that time to the person showing in symptoms is called as the incubation period. So now in this case as well, the patient did not start showing symptoms. It took a time of one month to start showing symptoms. And that is what is called as incubation period, which varies from weeks to months depending upon the replication, the speed of the replication of that virus, which in turn depends upon individual's immunity. At first, the patient started showing signs and symptoms of fever and weakness and this is called as prodromal phase. Now the patient in this case, the virus has reached the central nervous system and has started to replicate and showing different kind of symptoms. With time, gradually, the amount of replication and the amount of virus increases, the symptoms worsen and then the patient starts behaving abnormally. One of the most common signs of rabies is said to be hydrophobia now hydrophobia as the name suggests hydro means water and phobia is fear so this kind of patient has fear of water even a mug full of water if taken in front of that patient would scare him the patient also becomes restless anxious confused disoriented and also has trouble in sleeping How to actually diagnose this disease and how could one prevent it? So now diagnosis is something which should be done timely and there shouldn't be any wait. Even if your dog is vaccinated, then also you must rush to the doctor for further intervention. Now this is actually diagnosed by a direct fluorescent antibody test wherein biochemical test is taking place and the antibodies and antigens are combined to check the fluorescence so if you have fluorescence it means that the test is positive treatment yes there is a treatment and that is vaccine 
wish this child had told his parents about the problem and he would have been saved so in rabies there's a vaccine available which is also available at free of cost in government sector four doses at particular intervals and once taken it can save you from rabies now this dose this vaccine has to be taken immediately after the contact or immediately after the wound has taken place there's no time left if you delay it the chances of prevention or the treatment reduces now talking about rabies since it is 100% fatal so if you don't take this vaccine on time this leads to death which happen in the case i described above well as a doctor i believe that there is a proper need of education and immediate medical intervention in cases of rabies and that is why this video tells you uh, the importance of immediately going to a doctor if ever anything happens like this and also for the people who keep dogs with them do not forget to vaccinate them because they can be threat for you and for others as well so vaccination for them is equally important and if you like such content do not forget to subscribe to our channel and let's make this channel the biggest medical community ever